Wolf Governor Christie said his decision to set a special election to fill his state's open Senate seat was all about the people, but Democrats and even some Republicans argue it's really all about him. Good afternoon. New Jersey Governor Chris Christie made it clear that it was his authority and his alone to decide when the voters would be able to replace their late Senator Frank Lautenberg. The right thing is to let the people decide and let them decide as quickly as possible. In a big roll of the political dice, Christie set a special election date for October, little more than four months away. Citing the crucial legislative agenda in Washington, the governor argued it just wouldn't be fair to appoint a Republican successor to serve out the remainder of the Democrat Lautenberg's term, as many in the GOP wanted. I understand the political advantage that would come to me if I just, if I was the person, the sole person who decided who would be in the Senate representing New Jersey for 18 months. Um, but I just did not feel comfortable doing that. But Democrats say Christie's decision for an October 16th special reeks of politics because it comes three weeks before the governor is up for re-election. He made the tough decisions to get New Jersey back on track. Democrats insist Christie is just trying to keep Newark Mayor Cory Booker, the heavy favorite for his party's nomination, off the November ballot. Hi, I'm Cory Booker, and I love Newark. Why? Because a big Democratic turnout for Booker, they say, would help Christie's opponent, Barbara Buono, who admits in her own ad she's not that well known. I know that names can sometimes be tough to pronounce, so let me be clear. This guy is Bono. I'm Barbara Buono. Christie shrugged off the charge. No, there's no political purpose to this. The political purpose is to give the people a voice. Democrats also point to the special election's cost, estimated at nearly $24 million. The Democratic Governors Association said in a statement, Governor Christie might not know or care how many millions of taxpayer dollars his special election gambit will waste, but the people of New Jersey certainly do. Still, Christie's move could actually help Booker, who's already raising millions and sounding like a candidate. We've got to reform a broken immigration system, deliver marriage equality to all Americans, and bring sanity to our national gun safety laws. That may explain the differing reactions from the Democratic and Republican leaders in the Senate. And I won't, uh, I won't question the uh, path that he's chosen. I'm happy with what he's done. And the governor all but admitted to reporters he's managed to spice up his own race. So for all of you who were bored with the governor's race, I've now solved your problem. Yes, he has. As for who Christie will name as Lautenberg's temporary replacement until the October election, the governor's office said no decision has been made. Meanwhile, a senior advisor to Cory Booker said the mayor will make his decision at the appropriate time, but acknowledged he is very likely a candidate. But some Republicans are furious about this, Wolf. One top GOP strategist told me it would have been, quote, very helpful had Christie waited until 2014. But that's not going to happen.